Hi, what's the secret to getting ahead in this large language model revolution? Well, you have to know one important thing. That is that there are two kinds of models that you should care about. One is the completion model, and the other is the context model. Uh, so-called embeddings models, these are ones you hear are like Quen, GPT-5, whatever, really cool models. The completion model will finish the sentence. It'll fill in the blanks. It's uh, able to predict the next thing that something might want to say. Then there's the embeddings models. They're the ones that help you search through vats of text. Let's say there's a bunch of documents and you want to find something relevant to this conversation about AI. I'll say, huh, I wonder if there's documents related to AI. It'll find the top three documents. It'll stuff this conversation with phrases that I'm used to talking about, scissors, embeddings, models, whatever, whatever. Let's talk about AI. It's going to talk about the scissors, completion models, embeddings models, because I brought it context to complete the sentence. So two kinds of models, don't forget them. And lastly, the image space has so-called diffusion models that are very powerful. Basically, imagine squinting and creating an image. Uh, that's a whole other category model. They're interlinked with these large language models, but we'll get into that later. Let's keep going.